Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Zubair Rahman Sharif with another video log. Uh, right now, uh, what you can see here uh, is a Vega helmet. Nothing special about this helmet. Uh, so my video log today is all about helmets, what I use for city riding and uh, what I use for highway riding. Okay, so now coming to this particular helmet, what you can see on your screen. Uh, this is a Vega helmet and uh, this has just costed me 2000 rupees. Okay, now this particular helmet is real value for money guys because it has double visor. This is the um, transparent visor which is very important when you're doing night rides. Okay, and then during the daytime you have this. This is the uh, daytime during sunny days you can actually use this because it works like a shade okay now this particular helmet what I picked up from Vega is actually an ISI certified and if you have a check it's a dot certified helmet so Vega has done a great job and this actually weighs 1350 grams so a little bit over 1 kilo and 350 grams okay so now this is not just ISI certified it's also DOT certified right now. DOT certification is nothing but it's actually for uh, it's the safety standards of US. Okay, so you know that unfortunately in India, if your helmets, no matter how many, I mean, like how much you're spending on the helmet, maybe you might have spent a lakh rupees on the helmet, like AGVs or uh, showy on whatever it is. You know, if its ISI mark is not there, the cops will still catch you and they'll fine you because I don't know what's wrong with the Indian government authorities. I don't know what's wrong with them they still prefer isi mark so i picked this up because i normally use it in the city riding yeah so this is a beautiful helmet and it does the job uh, this particular helmet name is actually uh, force and it has some kind of a camouflage uh, camouflage uh, flage kind of a uh, uh, texture what we have it here so these are the vents which can be pushed like this okay so we have the vents here see this is the vents and then you have one vent here. I don't know what's wrong with this. Yeah. So these are the vents. Okay. And now you have the exhaust, which is from here. So these have, uh, this is not a double D locking system. It's just a clip type locking system here. So this is just a clip type locking system. Yeah. but. And it also has the chin curtain and there's one more good thing about this particular helmet if you look carefully here you can actually see some kind of a mesh kind of a stuff here yeah so this can be taken off this can be pulled out can you see this here yeah and this can be taken off and we can uh, clean it and put it back so this works like uh, you know uh, uh, like air filter so it's a really nice uh, attempt by Vega. So you can actually pull it out like this. See, you can pull it out. So a lot of uh, dust collection. See, can you see the dust getting collected here? So this you can wash it and you can put it back here. So that's a nice little bit, nice touch by Vega. For 2000 rupees, whatever you're paying, is a really good helmet for city rides. Yeah, so this is about the Vega helmet, guys. Now let me show you my helmet which is which i use it for highway rides and that's actually a dot certified and ecae certified helmet so let me get that helmet right now for you okay guys this is my um helmet for highway rides i'm going to uh take this off from this particular helmet bag and this is i don't know whether you can uh, get to know what it, uh, which brand it belongs to it's actually axor axor helmets yeah they are imported uh, and uh, Vega actually deals with them. It's a beautiful helmet and I'm going to show you my helmet setup. It has Bluetooth connectivity in this, which I have fixed it. Okay, and then I've got my uh, camera, uh, action camera mounted on it. And um, I also have something really amazing stuff on this particular helmet. A lot of people are actually thinking of this, but they're not getting this. And I'll just show you once I uh, remove this particular bag, what exactly, uh, what all things I've installed on this particular helmet, which is a great help for me when I'm actually doing highway riding. So let me just take this off for you here. Just hold on guys. Yeah, this is my 
helmet. Okay, there you go. Okay, so now this is my helmet setup. So I have, uh, I'll just show you the right round view of this particular helmet. Yeah, so this is Axor and this is my helmet uh, camera setup here. So even this is actually a twin visor. So you have the main visor and then I have this shade. So it's a double visor. Now this is a helmet mount. Normally what people do here is they try and stick um, the holder, hel uh, the action camera holder to the helmet. I didn't want to go with that because I, re I really didn't want to spoil the, uh, uh, you know, the paint job of this particular helmet. So I got this really good stuff from uh, AliExpress. This costed me 750 rupees. And uh, you know, this is just like a plug, uh, like a buckle kind of a stuff, which you can properly buckle it like this inside. Yeah, I'll just show it to you. Okay, so by the way, this is actually SJ7 Star uh, 4K action camera, which is the best alternative for GoPro. So if you run the video of uh, SJ7 Star or GoPro Hero, Hero 7 or Hero 8 during the daytime, believe me guys, you cannot make out any difference in the video quality in the daytime. But in the nighttime, you will find a little bit of noise in this particular footage of um, uh, SJ7 star but on GoPro you don't get it and also the super smooth videos yes this is really great amazing but of course GoPro is a level up and of course you're paying three times the price of this this costed only 10,000 rupees that you know it's around 25 to 30,000 rupees and one more very good thing about this here is you know I, I actually uh, set up a mic system here okay so this actually wire goes here and I have the mic installed here for my video audio logging video logging motor logging actually this is the mic setup here okay but on uh, gopro you have to install another adapter here which is not waterproof and that becomes really cumbersome because you know you have the camera setup here and then you have to go with that as well so it's a lot of things attached to a helmet so i didn't want to go with that so i'm pretty happy with this particular sj7 uh, star yeah now this is what uh, this helmet so now there's one more thing here just want to let you know so can you see this inside you will see this particular thing this is a uh, bluetooth um, uh, speaker system wherein the moment i receive a call automatically the call is picked up by the uh, this bluetooth system okay and then uh, i can answer the call and automatically the call gets disconnected once i finish yeah so that's about it and now comes the real part yeah now you know on highways uh, night riding is actually very dangerous and you have to make yourself seen by the uh, traffic which is following you from behind so now we need something so that the people uh, behind can identify you and this has to be at your eye level eye level of the driver who's coming behind you so now can you see a setup here now this particular setup if you have a check here now there is a small thing which is attached to it if you look at it carefully yeah so this particular stuff i'll just show it to you i just need to press this once and there you go yeah so this comes with a few patterns so this is like a quick um, strobe effect then if i press it once it has some kind of a movement and then another press it's like on yeah now if i press it again hold it down it just switches off now the attachment is very simple guys it's amazing because normally i heard uh, i've seen sol 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 helmet actually uh, comes with this kind of uh, inbuilt uh, built-in uh, what do you call that uh, these kind of uh, lights but this one i have to attach it and i'll just show it to you how exactly i managed to do this yeah if you have a check on this i'll just show it to you yeah all right now how it actually works here is now this particular thing this particular light this is actually de detachable can you see this here 
it's detachable and this is actually a bicycle rear light you know the tail light of a bicycle and i should say it's a coincidence or was it my luck that this particular mount you can actually have it on any action camera and you can stick it up here yeah you can actually uh, stick it up here and uh, once you stick it up this particular thing easily slides in here without any problem it easily slides in here and with a click it actually slides here yeah so that's so good about it uh, that uh, you know, uh, you can actually use it um, while you're doing highway rides and it looks super cool. Believe me, it looks super cool. Just press it and hold it for a few seconds and it'll switch on. And it looks amazing, guys. Yeah. And this costed me only 200 bucks, 200 rupees on Amazon. I'll share the link with you. Sometimes the cost is around 250, sometimes 210. I got it in the lightning deal. And now this particular stuff okay the uh, helmet mount i'm talking about this has one more feature in it i got this uh, in the sd cam package there, there are two clamps here if you have a check on this there are two clamps here if i hold it down like this and actually i can turn it like this so if at all you want to fix it like this you can fix it like this as well yeah it looks super cool so whatever you like whichever position you want to keep it in so you can keep it in and also you can actually turn it like this yeah so this complete setup costed me hardly 200 200 rupees that's it so uh, and this helmet and i've got this domino logo because i ride my domina 400 cc and now uh, this is like uh, this is dot certified and ece certified helmet and one more good thing about axor helmets here is it doesn't have wind noise guys no wind noise whatsoever so that's one irritating part you get whistling sound in the helmets when you're going uh, anything above 80 kilometers per hour there will be wind sound this doesn't have any wind sound yeah so this particular thing is amazing okay i hope you like my video and if in case you like my video please do subscribe like comment yeah and also share it with your friends and this could be really useful stuff for a lot of riders yeah i was searching for this particular uh, uh, thing from quite some time i found this fix and uh, i'm really happy hope you like my video and if you like my video please do subscribe and you can also find me on instagram which is zubair underscore ahmed underscore sharif yeah and i'll uh, upload all the high quality pictures there okay until then, take care, have a lovely day, ride safe, take care, bye-bye.